I went in for an MRI uh, on November 3rd. When I came out of the machine, um, I really thought that they were going to say, well, you need to make an appointment to see Dr. Black and you'll discuss in a week or two what the results were. Instead, um, they said, uh, your doctor says you need to get to emergency immediately. It wasn't what former City TV broadcaster and Ontario's 28th Lieutenant Governor expected to hear, that he had a brain tumor the size of an orange. Leading up to this, the Honorable David Onley was dealing with a decline in what he called mental functioning, which led to some falls. And it's got to come out immediately. And um, immediately turned out to be the next morning at 7 a.m. Instead of being uh, frightened, um, I was actually relieved uh, to hear the news because uh, I finally felt, okay, now we know what it is. He had a very sizable brain tumor uh, on, uh, on the, the frontal lobe in one of the one side of the head that has been always an extremely active and extremely uh, um, uh, like a productive individual and he was having a hard time because things were just not coming out the way he wanted them. Doctors told Onley that his tumor was determined not to be cancerous. They also asked Onley to take part in a study, the Momentum Study. It uses a machine called the MR Linec, which is the first machine in the world to combine radiation and a high resolution MRI. And we can actually see the tumor each day before we treat. And brain tumors, even meningiomas, can change and morph during treatment. And we want to capture those changes so that we can deliver our treatment better in terms of more safety, but also more effectively. And that's the hope of this, of this machine. Ultimately, why we have the trial is so that we can determine eventually in the longer term whether or not we impacted important outcomes such as survival. Uh, this is a said to various people, it is not a matter of saving my life, this is a matter of improving my quality of life and removing the possibility that this tumor could come back. If you're uncertain about the treatment that you're undergoing, check out the, um, the MR Linac uh, page at the Sunnybrook website. The way it works is that patients like Onley are fitted with a mask where doctors can precisely target the radiation. This helps to keep healthy brain tissue safe. It's about a half hour treatment that can take several weeks, which is a bit longer than traditional radiation therapy. In Toronto, I'm Brandon Rowe for City News.